opening with the king's pawn controls the center and opens up the light squared bishop and queen, often leading to sharp games. The Sicilian defense controls the d4 square with c-pawn. Nf3 develops the knight toward the center to prepare for a d4 pawn push, where the knight will recapture if black captures on d4. Nc6 helps control both the d4 square and the e5 square. The bishop is ready to be developed to an active square. The bishop is ready to be developed to an active square. This develops the bishop and gives it scope on the long diagonal. This fianchettos the bishop by placing it on a powerful diagonal. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. This develops a knight off its starting square, getting it into the action. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent avoids some of the attacking associated with opposite side castling. This prepares the bishop for development. This activates a knight by developing it off of its starting square. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is the last book move. One of the best moves. It is excellent. This protects an underdefended pawn that is under attack. It is best. This kicks an opposing knight. It is best. This move puts the knight on a safer square. It is best. This is the strongest option. It is best. A solid choice. It is excellent. This threatens to kick a bishop. It is a mistake. It is a miss. Recaptures. It is best. A very strong play. It is excellent. Takes back. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. This connects the rooks, which helps them coordinate together in the future. It is best. This forks multiple pieces. It is best. This move puts the queen on a safer square. It is best. This threatens to take an outpost with a knight. It is best. This reveals an attack on a knight. It is excellent. This defends a knight that was under attack and had no defenders. This is the only good move. This threatens to take an open file with a rook. It is a great move. The rook is now on an open file, which helps control squares across the board. It is best. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. It is good. Capturing that knight wins material. It is best takes back. It is best. This exposes an attack, threatening a queen. It is excellent. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. This is the way to win a pawn. It is best. Takes back. It is best. This threatens to win a pawn. It is best. This blocks the check from an opposing queen. It is best. Very precise. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. Right on target. It is best. Takes back. This is the start of the end game and black is equal. It is best. That pawn was free for the taking. It is best. This evades the check from the rook. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. This steps away from the checking rook. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This activates a rook by developing it off of its starting square. It is best. This ignores an opportunity to offer an equal trade of pieces. It is a mistake. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. One of the best moves. It is excellent. This overlooks an opportunity to activate the king by getting it off of the back rank. It is an inaccuracy. The rooks are coordinated and powerfully doubled on the file. It is good. White had an advantage, but now the game is close to equal. It is a mistake. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is excellent. 
an active king is critical in the end game and getting it off of the back rank is the first step. It is excellent. This is the strongest option. It is best. A solid choice. It is excellent. Very precise. It is best. This evades the check from the rook. It is best. Right on target. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This doubles the rooks onto a single file, which allows them to team up to create threats. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. This is the strongest option. It is best. A very strong play. It is excellent. This steps away from the checking rook. It is best. The game was close to equal, but now white has the advantage. It is a mistake. The game is still close to equal, but white lost their advantage. It is a miss. Very precise. It is best. This evades the check from the rook. It is best. Right on target. It is best. That's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. It is good. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. The game was close to balanced, but now white is worse. It is a mistake. Takes back. This threatens to win a pawn. It is best. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is a mistake. This overlooks an opportunity to move a piece to safety. It is an inaccuracy. This misses a much better move. It is a mistake. This makes a passed pawn, meaning no opposing pawn can challenge it on its way to promotion. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This is the strongest option. It is best. This is the only move that works. It is best. Very precise. It is best. This steps away from the checking rook. It is best. Right on target. It is best. This steps away from the checking rook. It is good. This is a fair move. It is good. This pushes a passed pawn. This is the only good move. It is a great move. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. That's an unfortunate error. It is a mistake. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. Placing a rook behind an opponent's passed pawn can inhibit the pawn's ability to promote. It is best. This defends the attacked pawn. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. One of the best moves. It is excellent. This steps away from the checking rook. It is excellent.